Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I'm called Glazia Janet. I'm a Ugandan and I'm based in Kasese. Are you planning to come to Uganda in 2024 or in the future? Are you a resident of Kasese and you are wondering where you should go while you're, you're staying here in Kasese? So today I want to take you to the top places you can visit while you stay in Kasese town. Uh, Kasese is located in western Uganda and uh, we are bordering uh, Congo and uh, Bundibuto. Uh, Kasese is one of the tourist uh, places in Uganda. So follow along as I take you to the top uh, destinations you can enjoy while you are in Kasese in western Uganda. Number one is Mount Renzori, one of the world heritages that was recognized by UNESCO in 1994. You can choose to go for a nature walk or go for eight days a hike up to Margarita Peak. The atmosphere and the cool natural vegetation will leave you in an alley as you walk through the national park. It is known for the uh, three-horned chameleon and different species of chameleons. A nice view, the good vegetation, and also you can uh, uh, spot uh, uh, forest elephants, uh, chimps, and other beautiful creatures like the beautiful Renzori Turaco. The park has more than 217 bird species, 70 mammals, and plenty of the alpine and the mountain vegetation. You don't need to worry about accommodation because it has, the park has so many campsites and accommodation places. You can choose to go for a group hike or go for a soul hike. The choice is all yours. Two, Queen Elizabeth National Park, commonly known as the Kazinga Channel and Uganda's second largest national park after Maxion Falls. When you're in this park, you can spot uh, a lot of animals, especially the lions chill out with the lions just in front of you what about that and this park is known for the uh, climbing lions a uh, lot of uh, animals in this national park including uh, antelopes buff buffaloes hippos the crested cranes the crocodiles lying on the backs of the lake it's amazing when you are in Queen Elizabeth, a national park. Besides the game drive, you can decide to go for a boat cruise on the Kazinga Channel. The Kazinga Channel ha uh, stretches over 44 kilometers from Lake George to Edward. Have a view of the elephants cooling down from the strong heat, uh, crocodiles lying on the backs of the lake, a lot of all the big five in the water are in here at the Kazinda Channel. Another thing you can do is to go for community hikes. Kasese has a lot of uh, hills. It's a good experience if you love uh, culture exchange, interacting with the locals and take yourself souvenirs that are handmade and also engage with the locals and try out a lot of experiences.
through these hikes they can lead you to interesting places like a lot of waterfalls kasese has a lot a lot of waterfalls and all these waterfalls are community owned so you only have to contribute to the community and this is an amazing way to express yourself when you're in kasese so try the community hikes and you will thank me later Hot springs. Hot springs are the places you can go to when you are in Kasese just to have fun, uh, learn, and enjoy yourself. If you are interested in having fun, you try Kiwa Heritage. It is a, com a culture and a community tourism site with a museum and craft shop. It has a stone preserved for the legendary sinker, the late Mose Radio. Continue resting in peace, legend. However, if you're interested in cool and spiritual places, uh, hot springs, then try Chiriwacha Tumba. Express the spiritual massage. <laughs> Kilembe Mines. Kilembe Mines is a historical copper mine located in Kilembe, 10 kilometers from Kasese town. Besides uh, the mines, you can have a good view. The scenic view of the area is amazing. The Renzori Founders is an outstanding artisan bronze casting place. It is found in Chamihoko. Like a village just one kilometer branch, Kasese Fort Poto Road. It offers a rewarding view and it has a forest where you can do some nature work. And the place has over 193 bird species, making it a perfect place for the, for the bird watching people. And uh, besides uh, the nature walk, you can go into their gallery and take yourself souvenirs of bronze. And also, they do not uh, charge uh, entry, but they ask you to donate uh, ten dollars per person who wants to go and experience the bronze casting process. The other things you can do in Kasese <laughs> are so many. Kasese has so many hills, so you can choose to go for picnics. You can choose to go for cycling, like a lot. Just try and do a lot of things. Do not forget to try the Kasese nightlife, guys. Because Kasese is a vibrant city. guys hope you enjoyed this video if you really liked the video just give it a thumbs up and uh, if you're new here kindly subscribe uh, share and don't forget to hit your notification now you know where you're supposed to go when you are in Western Uganda and when you're staying in Kasese so don't hesitate to, uh, to share this video to your friends so that they also get to know where to go while in Uganda Ciao! Love you guys!